this is the month of July. Let me see what is happening and transpiring. Let me see exactly what is happening and um, transpiring month of July. All right, so we are seeing the energy of victory and success overcoming a situation moving forward. Um, it is a powerful energy and you're overcoming a situation, um, but there's no new start. So whatever is transpiring, I see um, the sick, no new start and um, regrets. So Taurus is, I don't know what was happening, what was transpiring. Um, there is a um, no new start. This is just, it's as if a situation is coming up. The energy of the Empress. This energy of the Empress is a mother or a wife. It could be that your marriage is over, okay? And the energy of the Father of the Ones. Father of the Ones is an Aries, the or Sagittarian man, and his wife. And I see regrets. The Seven of Cups. A whole lot of emotional and regrets. They're now recognizing what this man and his wife have uh, um, did. Okay, debt to the end of a marriage for um, you um, women. Um, uh, end of a marriage. The four of swords. A lot of legal issues. They are now recognizing what an Aries, the or fire sign person have done. They have data and information. The Ten of Wands, a whole lot of burdensome situation for this man. So some of you Tauruses could have been your father um, and uh, his wife. This is a father situation and wife. This is a husband situation and you women. A judgment call is here. People are now recognizing and seeing the truth. And there is a judgment call. So... You are moving forward. You're overcoming. I see you Taurus women could be having an ending and a judgment call is coming up for Taurus women because people are now recognizing what is happening. The Eight of Wands, um, where a whole lot of information is going to be coming out and people are now going to be recognizing the Ten of Wands, your burdens is going to be over Tauruses. So, <coughs> so we have the Ten of Wands, the Nine of Wands, regrets, uh, a whole lot of regret for the situation. They recognize what a, um, that a um, Aries Lee or Sagittarian man and his wife uh, has created a whole lot of problems and had data and documentation that was not for them. A lot of you, um, Taurus businessman, is moving in and you're going to be ending some sort of a contract and business deal with an Aries Lee or Sagittarian man because you recognize this man was not honest. Maybe it's a brother, business partner, whoever this person is. No new start is here for a, um, a Taurus woman. I don't know what you women have done, but I see some sort of a data and information came out. Then we see the energy of uh, the Five of Cups. And the energy of the Five of Cups have to, make, to do with regrets. A whole lot of regrets, a whole lot of burdens. And I see a lot of you Tauruses are standing and protecting yourself. A lot of you Taurus men and your wife, a hand is coming into your marriage or relationship. And uh, if you are married to a Aries Lee or Sagittarian man, I see that they recognize and have data and information. A tower moment came down. They recognize what your father or your husband did. That is a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn. You women wanted some sort of a new start. And I see some sort of a data and information came out. The energy of uh, um, regrets. Um, a whole lot of emotional regrets. With a situation that has to do with a car. Some of you women wanted a car. Some of you women wanted to travel. An end is coming in. I see a whole lot of burdens because an Aries the or a Sagittarian man has created some sort of a problem for you. With and this and whatever is transpired, I see you Tauruses are going to be taking down this man because you recognize that this man created problems for you and your family. Whoever this Aries the or Sagittarian man is, a tower moment is coming down. This person is recognized and seeing what is happening and transpire emotions for you women and for mothers, Taurus mothers and Taurus wives, emotional judgment call is going to be coming down. And I see a lot of you Taurus women are trying to protect yourself 
from something. So I see an Aries or a Leo wanted some sort of a new start. It's not going to be happening. I see the energy of you women that is married with an Aries Leo or Sagittarian. A man had a regrets. You regret ever connecting with this man and ever doing anything with an Aries Leo or Sagittarian man. They recognize what I strings for. A transition is here and debt comes up with the energy of uh, uh, information. Transition, information, and end. A judgment call is here. And I see with this judgment call, um, I recognize that people are going to be seeing the truth of what was happening and transpiring. There's a whole lot of burdensome situation and things and issues and problems that a lot of you have to resolve in this month of July. Um, information is coming out that is going to be emotion, a whole lot of emotional situation. Five of cups. And a lot of you don't regret a situation. A lot of you feel as if... Uh, um, whoever this Aries Leo or fire sign man is, they um, they they really deserve what they have gotten. A lot of you women are going to be a problem, uh, protecting your data and information. An end is coming in, and some sort of a news is going to be coming in that is going to be bringing some sort of a judgment call. Okay, so let's go in and see. What is this energy that has to do with travel documents? You're going to be very successfully overcoming a situation. You Taurus is, is going to be getting a new start moving forward and some sort of a travel document, some sort of a car problem that was going on, some sort of a situation with travel. You're going to be successfully overcoming this because people are now going to be recognizing um, what was happening. A corporation institution, some of you wanted some sort of a new start with a corporation institution. It's not going to be happening, but it's okay. Let it go because you successfully overcome what they were doing. Um, a letter is going to be coming in and you're not going to be regretting. You're going to be actually happy um, that you have a, uh, a, you don't have to move forward with this corporation institution. You're going to be so happy um, that they released you from this situation that was transpiring. So a lot of success is going to be coming in and um, you know, you're know you moving forward and it could be that someone said, oh, we're not going to be extending your contract and you're like, oh, I'm so happy, thank you. <laughs> because you know whatever that was happening in this corporation institution, you found out some sort of an undesirable play and they are saying, well, you know, we have thought about it and this and this and that and whatever. And you're going to be saying, I'm happy that you feel that way. Um, me too. I see um, your mother or a Taurus woman is going to be, you Taurus women is going to be apologizing. Apologizing. I see a lot of you Taurus women are going to be apologizing and apologizing um, to maybe a child or a younger person. I see they recognize the dishonesty of a, Aries Leo or Sagittarian businessman, they recognize uh, that a business is not his uh, and they are ending a contract because they recognize this business is not his. So I see a lot of you um, are going to be receiving some sort of a message and it's very emotional, especially um, whatever this message is, is about uh, your husband. It's about your husband. If your husband is a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn man, it's about your husband because they're now recognizing and seeing the truth of who this man is. And they have data and information and is recognized. And I see a lot of you Taurus is, is going to be going back and apologize so, to someone or something because they recognize that they're um, a, um, a Aries Leo or Sagittarius man created a whole lot of problem. It could be your husband. But this man is a businessman. It's coming up as a businessman that created a whole lot of problem. It could be a supervisor or a boss. So, false Sita. The end is going to be coming into some false situation that was transpiring. They're now recognizing um, that a, um, a Aries businessman was a fraud. Okay, Aries Leo or Sagittarius businessman was a fraud. It is now coming to an end. I see this man is worried because this man has caught up in a whole lot of legal issues and is now worried. I see a Libra man is worried, but I see also an Aries Leo or Sagittarius man is worried. I see a whole lot of worries for this man because they have data and information and recognize what this man has done. Your enemy, whoever your enemy is and was, 
some of you was this uh, supervisor or this ex boss uh, um was creating issues and problems that um um your enemies have a lot of burdens to carry now because they're recognizing um some sort of a fraud that your enemies have uh, created okay oh my god some sort of a fraud that your enemies have created and i see that they're now recognizing and seeing the fraud um and the this uh, the dishonesty um and this enemy some of you a sagittarian um was your greatest enemy and you're going to be successfully overcoming the sagittarian now taurus is you could have done um, some sort of a business with a sagittarian and um the sagittarian was your greatest enemy whatever the news is coming in i see an end i end for a I uh, end uh, um, for a group of people that has created a whole lot of problems. So there is no new start um, um, for some of you ladies. I see some of you ladies are going to be getting some sort of a news and you don't regret the news. You're, you're like, now I'm, I appreciate this. I'm happy. Um, a lot of you are going to be successfully overcoming um, a situation where they recognize uh, some uncalled for situation that was created and they're going to be recognizing that there was some sort of a false that was transpired judgment a family is going to be receiving some sort of a message um whoever this family is and whatever is happening there is a judgment call for a family and um um this is, you know, this is a family, is some of you family, a judgment call. They're now going to be recognizing how a Aries Day or a Sagittarian man has come up with a lot of wealth. Um, they're now a spitting shoe and recognizing how this person came up with his wealth and recognizing that this man has used um, some sort of a data and information from someone from another country. And that is how they came up with their wealth. So another country is going to be investigating a Aries businessman and recognizing what this Aries man, businessman have done and how this Aries businessman has uh, accumulated wealth on the false pretend. So a lot of you are going to be successful, successfully overcome um, what was going on. The first week, a news a letter is going to be coming in and you are going to be happy about this letter coming in, okay? Then we see in the second week, a lot of you are going to be receiving some sort of a news that um, a contract is not going to be extended and you're going to be okay with it, okay? However it is, um, you're going to be okay with it. You're kind of happy, okay? Because you were planning on leaving a job or a situation anyway. Um, moving forward is going to be successful when it comes up with business. And uh, um, your enemy was created some burdens and now they have their burdens to bear. So let it go. You women, you, 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 you know, you are worried about your, your husband. Um, you women, um, your husband have created a whole lot of issues um, that has cost you a lot. Okay. And whatever is happening and transpire, you women are kind of, recognizing that you know this person just constantly create chaos in my world um and you women are going to be putting a stoppage to it it's as if you women just recognize i can't deal with this person anymore and um, this person i created so much chaos for me that you know it is no time that i release myself of this person you know it's always chaos 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 and always you know creating a whole lot of stuff that is affecting my world and you're going to be recognizing you know this is this is no love this is no relationship this is just someone who is very chaos and like to create chaos you know when when they know they should go right they go left or, or when they know they should do something they just wait until the last appointed time that create another chaos um in your world and for your family and I see that a lot of you are going to be recognizing this is not healthy. This is not a good place. So a lot of you are going to be um, successfully um, in the first house. You're going to be sex successfully overcoming an Aries man. Um, a lot of you are going to be recognizing what an Aries man have done to your car 
or what an Aries man has done to your information, they're going to be recognizing that an Aries man is someone who had done something to your car or some sort of a travel document or information. They're now going to be seeing that it's an Aries that has done it, whether man or woman. It's coming up as a masculine energy. In the second house with money, I see a young person is coming back to apologize to you. Um, it could be a child that is returning some money. I see a child could be coming and visiting some of you, but this child is only visiting because they need money. So you mothers, you be aware of why this child is coming back in your life. Third house of environment, I see an end is coming to uh, some sort of a false situation that was happening and transpiring. They're going to be recognizing the falls, uh, the falseness that was created. And it could be that a Gemini, I end this coming to a Gemini because they recognize that a Gemini is very false. This is a third house of a Gemini or is someone in your environment is very false. Okay. Then we look at the house of family and there's a good judgment call that is going to be coming down on some of you. Some sort of unexpected news of your family is going to be coming in. When we look at the house of the Leo, the Leo wanted some sort of a new contract or some sort of a new contract. It's not going to be happening. They recognize that this Leo is uh, and has created a whole lot of problems. Leo is not going to be receiving a new start or a new contract with a company or with a house or with a business. So then when we look at the house of the Virgos, the everyday duties is that some of you are going to be recognizing that the Aries man was either using your data and information and your business information and was accessing um, information of your business. This Aries businessman, they're going to be recognizing what this man has done. A Virgo is going to be speaking up about this Aries businessman and they're now going to be finding out what this Aries businessman have done. Then we recognize that there's a situation where we see um, the thoughts and the thoughts is uh, um, in the house of uh, the eight house. So a lot of you are thinking about your marriage. A lot of you men and women are thinking about your marriage and thinking, you know, do I want to move on with this marriage or this? Uh, it is really a marriage because it's the house of marriage contracts. Uh, and, uh, you know, a lot of you married people are wondering, do I want to stay in this marriage or get out? That is going to be happening. Then when we look at the seven house of contract, they're going to be recognizing that contract was made and money was made and they're going to be recognizing a scorpion what a scorpion does and how a scorpion create a whole lot of contract in order to get money on the false pretend okay so it is the house of the the scorpion the scorpion could be um telling or they could be finding out what a scorpion have done in order to acquire a whole lot of money when we look at the house of the Sagittarian, I see some of you could be getting some sort of news from a Sagittarius. And I see you're happy with this news, okay? Whatever the news is, you have no regret. And news is coming in from another city or another place, and you have no regrets. And this is going to be good. So, perfect. Huh? Then we look at uh, the house of uh, the tent house of reputation. I see emotional. A lot of you are very, very emotional. Emotional. And I see a lot of you have to apologize to a Capricorn. I don't know what some of you have done to a Capricorn, but I see you are apologizing to a Capricorn and is um, balancing something out for a Capricorn. Some of you could have tried to ruin this person's reputation. And I see some of you are coming back and is trying to balance out some sort of a problem with a Capricorn. Um, then when we look at the 11th house, you have enemies and you have a whole lot of enemies, Tauruses. You got to look out because you have a whole lot of enemies. So Tauruses, um, you know, a group of people are just working against you. So you got to look out for your enemies. So in the house of the 12th house, we see the energy of a lot of karmas that a lot of you are trying to work out a lot of karmas and let go of this karmas because a lot of you um got connected with some sort of a karmatic situation that you need to release okay all right so we see the energy of the sun um tauruses you're going to be very successful over a situation i see the thinking man so a lot of you taurus men 
are going to be successfully overcoming a situation and you went inside and looked for the answers. You recognized that something was kind of off balance and you went in inwards looking for answers to resolve some sort of a situation and you have find the answers and a lot of you are going to be really really comfortable so success plans that work out in the best possible way a lot of you men are going to be thinking to create some sort of a family problem you men are going to be working out the four of spring is here um be grateful you have much to celebrate the four of spring is about celebration the four of one so a lot of you could be celebrating going out um and uh, whatever the uh, the problem is uh, deep feelings of peace and happiness uh, a connection of personal life so celebrating a lot of you success and celebration is coming up for you tauruses this is going to be good financial restraint i see a lot of you men are having some sort of a financial restraint is it with your business what is happening what is transpiring a lot of you men are thinking about your financial situation a lot of you men could have invested in a lot of stuff so be aware I see the queen of summer comes up in the reverse. So a lot of you, the queen of summer is a scorpion woman comes up in the reverse. I see a lot of you Tauruses is going to be celebrating over a scorpion woman. Okay, whoever the scorpion woman is and whatever that was transpired. I see journey, journey. I see an end for the scorpion woman. They recognize what the scorpion woman have created. They are now aware how the scorpion woman have created a whole lot of issues. And I see an end is coming up for the scorpion woman. Some sort of a letter information. Yeah, there's definitely a scorpion woman in a corporation institution. An end is coming up because they recognize uh, um, what is transpiring. So a lot of you are going to be successfully overcoming a scorpion woman. I see this person is going to be journeyed. So um, this person is uh, going somewhere else. This person, an uh, end, a contract for the Scorpion woman in a corporation institution is going to be ending. They recognize um, what this uh, Scorpion woman have been doing um, in this corporation institution. They recognize that the Scorpion woman could have defraud and fraud a bank, a financial institution and help someone to do it. This is definitely um a pisces cancer a scorpion woman and i see regrets for this woman whoever this woman is they rec recognize what this woman have done i see an end and the truth is going to be revealed a journey i see a lot of you men um are going to be having some sort of a con um constraint financial strain because you want to travel and you can't travel and i see some sort of a journey um is here where um, a lot of you men wanted to go someplace, could be a family holiday, um, but you are financial strained. Okay. So we see success over, um, at the workplace over a scorpion woman for some of you, some of you is a Pisces cancer scorpion woman. I see a Taurus woman is going to be coming back to apologize to a lot of you. And, um, I see, um the you Taurus women is is going to be apologizing to a um Capricorn woman because you recognize that an Aries man had lied and had took money or business on the false pretend saying that they were the one and now people are now recognizing that this Aries man was not the person. False Cita comes up and false Cita comes up in the energy of a friendship, friends, um siblings, brothers and sisters. But it is the house of the Gemini, so it could be a false Gemini. And I see that this person is now worried because this person created a whole lot of conflicts. This person, this Gemini, could have been your enemy, or it could be a friend who could have been your enemy. A Libra man is now recognizing that uh, he's in some serious problem. Whoever this Libra man is, have created some sort of a problem, and he is now in some serious problem. Family issues, and I see you men are going to be worried. You wanted to take your family on a vacation but financially 
I, I see some of you Taurus men is going to be losing a lot of money on the stock market. It's as if you, uh, you Taurus men put your money in a lot of stuff overseas. And whatever is happening to you Taurus men is as if you can't get this money in order to take your family on a vacation. Okay. All right. So let's see. The buffalo. Oh my God. You have the buffalo and uh, the gazelle. Yeah. The energy of the buffalo is in the two weeks, the two first week. This is an earth energy. This is like the elephant. And you, Tauruses, are going to take up the energy of the buffalo in order to resolve a situation. The gazelle, the gazelle, another fast energy coming out in this. Um, Third week going in the fourth week, another fast energy moving fast, balancing out problems, issues, situation that was created. This is totally positive. This is heavy. This is powerful. Um, this is where the gazelle and the buffalo um is going to be really moving you forward because you come in with a masculine energy. So whether you're a man or a woman, you come in with a masculine energy. And you're raising, raising the frequency and the energy in the last week. And this is good. So the buffalo and the gazelle, this is so beautiful. Enjoy. I do love you guys. Please like, share, and support. Thumbs up. Namaste. Until next time. All right.